everybody. Uh, Phoenix Carnivale. My question's for Rory. <laughs> Rory, you kind of grown up with the sport. You, you've kind of matured. Can you talk about some of the defining moments that make you ready to go for this championship? You know, I, I can't pinpoint anything. I, I, both my losses were, were huge for me growing, um, identifying weaknesses, not only uh, technically, um, but mentally it was, it was, has been a big, uh, big part of it. So, uh, you know, I'm thankful for all the experience I've had in MMA, the ups and the downs. And, uh, you know, I, I, it's all of it's a blessing and I'm happy to be here. All right, now my next question is for Connor. You're, you seem to be one of those people who enjoys the media circus, who enjoys the limelight. Can you talk about some of the best perks that you've experienced so far? I mean, it's part of the business. It's something you must fall in love with. You must, I honestly see it as a separate discipline. There's boxing, there's wrestling, there's jujitsu. But there's also media obligations. That is a separate discipline. And fighters can't be broke under that spotlight. It can drain them. And they lose the fight before it even begins. So it is something that I have learned to fall in love with. Not any particular part of it. Just in general, I have learned to accept it. And I have learned to become comfortable. That is what I am about. I become comfortable in the uncomfortable. Dana, would you consider... Connor's behavior to be sort of the perfect guy to kind of have on one of these media tours? What's the, is he the perfect guy? Yeah. Well, he doesn't suck. You know what I mean? He's, he's pretty good at it. But, uh, you know, both of these guys have done a great job. We, th this tour we've done is unprecedented. We've never done anything like this. We, you know, we've done a few cities here and there. We've never done anything like this. This thing started in Rio. And everywhere we've been, this thing is, is pretty taxing, man. We, we, we end up in the city and then fly out the next day. And, and, and both of these guys, Jose and Connor, have both, have both been rock stars during this thing. It's been great. Awesome. And Jose, you have to deal with, you know, everybody is always after what you have, and you have to deal with this. But has he been the most difficult for you to deal with? And what strategies do you use to not let him get under your skin? Então, já tá é, muito tempo eu já tô com o cinturão. Então, já tô acostumado com tudo. Hoje em dia, graças a Deus, a experiência tá do meu lado. Então, não só ele, mas outros virão também falar, fazer a mesma coisa. Mas todos vão cair como sempre caíram. I've been the champion for a long time. I'm ready for anything, anyone. They're all gonna talk, but I'm gonna keep my reign and they will all fall.